Well, hey guys, how are we doing today? So what we are doing today is, um, I don't know, we get often asked to, uh, I guess where I work, there's always trades guys around where I work and whatnot, they're, I don't know, some, some of the vehicles they run just don't have the best batteries and whatnot, but anyway, so we're making just a real quick, um, quick cable set that would allow you to um, boost somebody without actually lifting your hood, just having the connection on the outside, whether it's on the front bumper, rear bumper, and then just having another connection that hooks up to that with some uh, with some cables or some clamps at the end of it. So what we've done, both Mike and I here, we've gotten, uh, we bought these cable sets, these booster cable sets from uh, Amazon. So anyway, it just these are the quick connectors here. So as you can see, once everything is all put into place, um, those just snap into place like that. And that's how that works. But anyway, um, we've stripped our ends here. I guess these ones I've stripped. Mike stripped his as well. So we actually uh, we may have to make a trip to uh, PA just to get some proper uh, pieces of this. This is a one gauge. That's a two gauge, and seems to be a lot of movement. But anyway, we're gonna just uh, take a look at this. See. Okay, so what we've done right now, we're just uh, working on Mike's set here. So he's cut a portion of the cable, as you can see there. And what we're doing is we're going to be fitting these on the ends. You just have to make sure that when you put these on that they're both sitting the same way. So if you look at them there and not having it like this, one like that, one like this in that respect, uh, just the way that they fit inside, inside here, they fit in a certain way and they lock in place. Yeah, so you can see there how it locks in place and whatnot. But anyway, we just have to get that started. And uh, yeah, so we'll get, I'll actually show you what we have to do here. Okay, so you can see that. So we just got to do the same thing to this side here. Just rotating it on. Yeah. So that. Just keeps all the wires in and stuff. You're not going to get them all. Yeah, you'll get all. You always get a few, but there. Okay. So we have this little tool hill tool here, and it is uh, essentially just a big crimper. Um, you slide this inside of here, and there's just basically got a point in there and whatnot. And uh, what we got to do is just pound that thing down, so you can see see what we got. Here. So just make sure you have your orientation right of your pieces here. Um, that little bump, you got a you got a catch on the bottom inside there, which is going to catch a little tab inside there. So once you push everything in, it locks in place, just like that. And you can see that they're all completed in there. And there we go. And that's the first set of cables completed. Now we just have to put the uh, tabs on the end that are going to hook up to the battery. And that's what these are. So we're going to have to figure something out. Um, I think we can probably figure it out. So this piece here, this is the piece here that's going to be hooked to the battery. And these are the ends here that are going to connect to my uh, dual battery, my Genesis dual battery kit. And then when you need to boost anybody, this will connect in here. And then I've got my booster cables, the crimps or the clamps right there. So there we go. Um, that total, um, I believe we were probably about $70 total to make one set, which is actually a really good price. Uh, we got the cables as well as uh, uh, these ends here all on Amazon. And 
and uh, those those connectors that we have right there, we got those at, just at a local hardware store, Prince's Auto. But very easy to make. Um, what I'll do is I will try and include the uh, try and include the uh, links for the uh, for the cables as well as the connectors. Uh, so that if you need to go get some or you want to order some, you can get those yourself. But if you do have any other questions at all, please let me know. Um, and I'm, again, thank you for watching the video, and uh, everybody have a great day.